What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Raven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Brilliant Diamond walkthrough. Yeah, your boy is back. He's been back. Speaking. Right here. <laughs> Holy buckets. Okay, so yes, in our last episode, guys, it was our grand return to voice narration and all that crud, and uh, to this game, too, because, well, a lot of you guys are vocal. You know, telling me, hey, you need to finish that walkthrough. I know. I'm going to get to it at some point. <laughs> Anywho, guys, uh, here we are. In our last episode, we went through, you know, Route 220, uh, 212. We are still there. Now we're going to be going into the Trophy Garden, the Pokemon Mansion and all that stuff. There will be quite a few trainers that we can battle and all that crud. Um, quite frankly, I think I'm just going to be battling, like, Whatever. And let's see. Just between you and me, all this patrolling can get pretty demanding. Ah, it is. It is demanding. And, uh, again, take a look at the bushes just in case, you know, you'll find some items and all that crud. Um, let's see. What else? What else? Nothing right there. Uh, you know, that, that Pokemon is starting to remind me of a specific pet. Oh, and look at that! I completely forgot that Pokemon can do that. We got ourselves a Pomeg Berry. Do not know what that does, but... It still works. And, uh, well, let's see. Right here, we're gonna be walking. We're strutting our stuff, you know. Looking like a, you know, big old piece of carne asada right there. Yeah, the carne asada. And, well, there you go. Look at that. Super potion. Got ourselves a super potion. And, uh, well, if you could just move out of the way. Like I said, it reminds me of a specific pet. Wink, wink. <laughs> And, uh, let's see. Oh, well, look at this. Wants to move faster and it's tugging me. Again, reminds me of a specific pet. Wink, wink. And, uh, well, let's see. Right here, nothing. Uh, I am looking for items. Hidden items, okay, guys? And I'm gonna get in between these two people. And we're gonna battle them, yes! Okay. Anywho, in our last episode as well, guys, we talked about main reasons to why I decided to take a nice break, and I mean a, lo a long sense of break from all this speaking right here. And today, we are going to be talking about motivations on getting back right here. Wow, Draven came back with a spiritual awakening. No, not really. <laughs> I just, uh, I just missed you guys. Kinda. I missed you guys. A little bit. Um, let's see. We're just kicking butt and taking names. And wow, what is it with the Intimidate? Everybody has Intimidate. Oh my lord. Oh, come on. Hurry up, hurry up. Okay, so, anywho, uh, let's see. What motivated me into coming back right here? And that was very simple, guys. Uh, many of you guys, I saw your comments. I've been, actually, I've been keeping track of all the comments that you guys have had uh, right here. Some I lose track of because, you know, I've been busy. Extremely busy, super busy, and uh, the, the the one thing that was you know the one thing that was uh, actually you know just uh, a constant and that was hey uh, when are you gonna speak again? Hey, we miss Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. Hey, uh, when are you gonna come into Pokemon Sun and all that stuff? And you know part of it yeah was was you guys um, you guys made it very clear that you know I am actually doing a very good job right here onto YouTube and. Um, you know, I'm, I'm having fun with it. I do have fun with it. Uh, the last episode, I did explain that, you know, your boy kind of got burnt out from overdoing it a little. And, you know, you, you we've seen a lot of PokeTubers onto YouTube uh, come and go. Uh, one comes, like, two, actually two that come to mind are Light, Dark, Neutral. Um, that, that YouTuber was the reason to why I got into PokeTuber, PokeTubing, I should say. And, uh... Like about a year or two ago, he came back. We talked briefly, um, and he tried to regain, you know, his status and all that stuff. But then, you know, eventually life got to him and all that stuff. So that's another one, um, and another one, uh, Luroy. And well, if Luroy's watching, this, shout out to you, bud. Uh, yeah, life just happens, guys, and uh, that's kind of what happened with me. Life happened, and uh, well, it wasn't just life. It was life and I got burnt out and uh, well not in particular order and all that stuff but 
kind of missed you guys. Uh, this is the way out to the trophy garden. The way the garden is open for all visitors to enjoy. However, please beware: wild Pokemon may appear in the garden. You will be getting some rare Pokemon there. Um, so, yeah, those two Poketubers right there, they came and they left, left nice impact and all that stuff. I am sure it was because life happened, and, uh, you know, it happened to me, and, well, I'm not loafing off, I'm just taking a personal break, me too. That's kind of, <laughs> that's kind of me right there. I'm not loafing off, I'm taking a personal break. Wow, I'm gonna use that as my screen. <laughs> oh, man, I'm gonna use that as my... <laughs> Okay, all right, hold on, just a sec. <laughs> oh, Lord, okay, so... There you go, guys, that was... I don't need to tell no more stories, that's exactly what I was going through. I'm not loafing off, I'm just taking a personal break. Ugh. And, let's see, let's go ahead and talk to this lady right here. Um, you know how, to ca how you can catch Pokemon in the trophy garden? If you put this on a, uh, a caught Pokemon, it warms up to you faster. I'll share one with you, so give it a try. And here we get ourselves a Soothe Bell. Okay, so that... That item I was actually looking for. I, I thought that I've had it before, but I guess I was wrong. So, if you guys don't know, a Soothe Bell right here is an item to be held by a Pokemon. The comforting chime of its bell calms the holder, making it friendly. And as many of you guys already know, I do have one Pokemon that uh, needs that so it can evolve into its next stage because, you know, it needs to, it needs to be happy. And that is Talk to Batman right there. So, uh, yeah, we want to swap its Shell Bell for a Soothe Bell. Oh, wow. That's the wrong Pokemon. Good God. Okay. Uh, hold on. Hold on. What did I do? Holy crud baskets. Okay. There we go. Shell Bell. Okay. Uh, yeah, we kind of need to make uh, Toxic Batman a little bit more friendly because, well, yeah, you know, he can evolve into a big, strong Batman and all that stuff. And, uh, well, let's go right here. There you go. Toxic Batman is now going to be more friendly to us, not bite us and suck blood and everything. Yeah. And, uh, well, let's see. Let's go right up here, see what we got. And we're going to be finding ourselves a Great Ball, which... That's good. That's good. Good stuff. Good stuff right there. And, uh, well, let's see. Let's grab this. This trash is empty. And, uh, well, we're going to be battling that lady in just a little bit. We're going to go towards the other side. So let me let me run through the hallway right here. Wow, I just got out of work and I saw somebody running through a hallway. A little zoomy. And, let's see. Mr. Backlot is the master of this house. This is his office. Okay, let's see what this office holds. And here is Mr. Backlot. Hello, hello! Welcome to my opulent mansion. <clears throat> There's a lot for me to be proud of inside and outside of this home. But what makes me the most proud is my trophy garden in the back. Why bother traveling afar when Pokemon are attracted by my garden? They come to me. You're welcome to join them and, uh, and marvel at my garden. Okay, alright. And the butler here is like, Master actually quite enjoys showing his prize garden to strong trainers. I am pretty strong, huh? Very, very strong. Super strong. And this guy here is like, I'm very sorry. Please refrain from touching this statue. What is so special about that? Has they have has anybody answered that? Let me know. Comment down below, guys. You are more than welcome to. And here we found ourselves a TM87 Swagger. Not Jack Swagger, but Swagger. And many of you guys already know that right there confuses or severely confuses your opponent, but uh, it increases its attack a lot. Like a lot, a lot. Like catch these hands a lot. Can't be good. So what we're gonna do, I um, just going off of instinct right here, guys. I'm gonna go right here, let's see. I'm so sorry, everything beyond this point is strictly off limits. If I remember correctly, they did not answer that part too. Let's go right ahead and start battling because, well, I guess we need to battle. So, here you go. How's it going? I'm so sorry everything beyond this point is secret and off limits, and I guess we're not battling. Wasn't this, wasn't this the place where you actually had to, like, beat the opponent, like, six times in six turns or something? I don't even know, guys. I guess it doesn't work here. Holy buckets. Okay. So, let's go straight into the trophy garden and find ourselves some pretty rare Pokemon. Um... If I'm not mistaken, some of these Pokemon are baby Pokemon, like Pichu, Eevee, 
And would you look at that, we found ourselves a wild Pichu. Okay, Monfernomon, let's go, let's get it. And, well, Monfernomon is happy to see us. We got ourselves a female Pichu, so what's going to happen here is I'm going to use one of them quick balls because, yes, these Pichu are still quick. One turn, come on, stay in that Pokeball. One, two, three, throwing out that B sign, yeah. I'm that good. I still am that good. All right, so here we get experience points, and uh, well, here is Pichu's data into the Pokedex. Here it is, Pichu, the tiny mouse Pokemon. The electric sacs on its cheeks are still small. They cannot store much electricity yet. Oh, baby Pokemon, and well, it is a female Pichu. As many of you guys already know, we got a name her. I bequeath you the name. Let's see. How do I spell her name? How how do you forget your niece's name? Or how do you spell oh wow. She's gonna be mad at me. Okay, okay, here we go. Baby girl, if you're watching this, I am so sorry. <laughs> and well, here we go. Aliyah. That's I think that's how you spell the name. Let me take a look. It is. Baby girl, if you're watching this, I am so sorry. Anywho, pressing that button, and Aaliyah will go straight to the Pokebox because, well, kind of don't need her right now. Anywho. Wow, she is going to be mad at me. Okay, so I think there's another Pokemon here that we can actually capture that I may or may not want. And it's not this Pokemon. It definitely isn't this Pokemon right here. So, Monfredomon. We're not going to do anything except just uh, bounce around. And... You know, take directions and all that stuff. Anywho, um, let's see. Uh, I haven't explained much about my motivations and all that stuff, right, guys? No, not really. Um, another thing too. Um, you know, I, I really, I really do, I really do miss doing this. Yes, it's paying me, um, but that's not the motivation right there. The motivation is that I am an entertainer. I, I do love doing the entertainment things. And when I get in a rut, kind of like I did about, how long ago? Wow, seven years ago? When I rebranded this whole this whole channel from Draven XC711 to Gym Leader Draven. When I get into a rut, I start looking at other PokeTubers' videos and see what kind of ideas I can bounce around and get and all that stuff. And um, like I said, I... At the top of my head, I can't really tell you which Pokemon trainers, which PokeTubers um, I can give you, except for maybe Munching Orange. So shout out to Munching Orange. Um, yeah, it, it's just I, I bounce around ideas. I take a look at what they do, what what exactly do they do differently, and how can I incorporate it into my channel and all that stuff. And what I do is um, I like to play replay the old school games because that's where I'm at. That's my childhood right there. Um, in fact, my childhood ended right at Generation 3, and we went into teenage years, and from there I was playing sports. A lot of sports. So it, it wasn't until, like, college where I was, like, really... Yeah, I was really doing stuff and, and, and actually getting back over here. Um, yeah, there's just a lot of stuff that I, I, I just realized I saw in those videos that, you know, hey, I can incorporate it right here and I can make them my own. That way you guys stay entertained and stay informed and all that stuff. Especially um, brand new uh, brand new subscribers, viewers, you know, that, you know, happen to run in my channel. Um, a lot of changes that many of you guys have seen over the years. The language. Not a lot of cussing, guys. I Things have changed on that stuff. Um, and then, uh, what else? Just the decoration, the decor, and uh, let's see what else. Just a lot of stuff that you know I was learning, especially improving on my uh, on my video making skills and all that crud too. So yeah, just uh, just a lot of changes right there, and then uh, you know proper motivation from a friend, from a family, and uh, you know someone new and all that crud too. It just. Uh, it all came together, and it was like, this is the proper time to actually start entertaining you guys again here on YouTube. So, that's that's where my mindset is right now, um, especially with the limited time that I have. 
he could work out. Um, I have a, I have a set schedule. It's always about planning and all that stuff, scripting and all that. So I'm ready to go. I'm ready to not burn myself out. Again. I'm actually going to be a little different this time, especially with how I come out with videos. Things change, guys. Life changes, and uh, well, there we are in Route 212. We're going to be finishing up the whole thing in the next episode. Yes, I get it. It was short. It was me just talking about this, this, and that, and whatever. But you know what? I think I could save it for the next episode. That way we can like figure out more things in this, in this game right here. So, again, guys, thank you guys again for being patient. Very, very patient with me um, for watching and all that stuff. Viewing and supporting. I will be back next Tuesday for another episode of our Pokemon Brilliant Diamond Walkthrough. See you guys.